hi guys welcome to today's video it is early in the morning and it is a balmy a minus 20 degrees minus 20 degrees negative 20 that's without the wind chill I don't even know what that is um, it is warming up though and hopefully it'll be a little bit warmer because whoo it's one of those days when you suck in and it, it feels really hard on your lungs so um, anyway a lot's in store for today what are we doing today Ride and go to. Yeah, we're gonna take this opportunity to ride him just so we can see. Like, her first ride went so well, but there's so many things to consider with Elise. A lot of things that we have to figure out. And um, a race car driver is gonna meet us at the barn later when it warms up a bit and see what happens. But before we do that, we are gonna go down and check on our horses and give them some food. girls whoa girls take care of the food the grain and vitamins and supplements and I take care of the water and the hay the best parts right the best parts for mom oh it's not too bad in here like literally I walk in here and it's 100 degrees warmer okay not 100 degrees hello miss happy girl she's like give me my food did you eat all your hay did you poop all right it's all good you guys I dreamed last night I dreamed at four o'clock in the morning um, and somebody said, go down and check on the horses in my sleep. And I was like, oh my gosh, how am I going to sleep after that? Like, what if something's happening down there? Like, I'm afraid. And it turned out so far it's good. But sometimes when I dream something, it isn't for that day. It sometimes goes later. I'm excited for a day when this girl loves us so much, like Stella. Because this girl really does love us so much. She's like, give me the food. It's coming. It's coming. Stella's like, give me my food. Look at her ears. I've never seen her ears so pointed forward since she moved here. And I, I like to mix it. you like to mix it. The poor little horse is sitting there saying, give me that food. And you're like mixing it and taking your time. She's like, give it to me. So you guys didn't see her feet. And she's got some cute little foots going on now. I thought I saw a piece of wood. She pushes all her hay to the door so she can watch uh, Stella while she eats. Uh, of course. Mm -hmm. Guys, we have a special guest to have fun today. Ruby! Ruby! Good girl. Did you hear that snort? It's our snorting girl. Our snorting girl and our give me the food girl. Yeah. I feel like this is winter's last hurrah for us because it is pretty hurrah. Here, I'm going to lead her out with Come on, get going. She wants to go. And you're a horse and your owner. Slow, slow, slow. She's like, get me out. Get me out of this thing. See how she's got like the wide eyes showing the white of her eye and she's still nervous and still confused about what's happening. Stella used to have that. And now she never has it. Yeah. Ruby, don't knock it kicked. Typically we clean stalls right now, but it's literally so cold. Like, I, I don't think, Are yeah. The same There's no way. I'm even going to close this door today because it's that cold outside. This is winter's last hurrah. Alright guys, I'm just folding laundry. It's so warm and it's so cold outside. I just want to snuggle in the laundry. Usually Macy sees me with the laundry and comes flying over. Watch this. She loves herself some heat. So does Same. Sophie. Um, I want to give you guys like a little quick update on a couple of things you guys have been asking me about that I keep forgetting to update you on. Um, number one uh how have i been healing am i completely healed no no i'm not completely I'm not healed either yeah i was doing really really well but then once i had to start carrying water down to the barn it really put a lot of stress on my pelvis um and so i have some really sore spots still um i, I just minor just annoying sore spots 
Older puppies love themselves some Some more. days are worse than others, but I'm doing okay. I also have a couple of weak spots. It's just kind of like, you know, when you don't use certain muscles for a, for a couple of months, then you kind of lose it. So when I walk to go up the stairs, I have to use all my muscles. So everybody has found the laundry pile now. Oh yeah, when I like, I'm trying to do certain things like walk up the stairs or walk quickly, I use different muscles than I would normally use because I try and stay away from my butt muscles, but I'm doing much better. Um, the other thing that you guys want an update on is the saddle. I've been trying not to talk about the saddle. So frustrating. I have like so much to share. All I can say is this. It's supposed Scam. to be done. It's supposed to be done. February 28th, the CEO of the company has informed me that it will be done on February 28th, 28th, and then we'll get it 10 days later. If the saddle is not ready on February 28th, rest assured, I'll be making a massive video, a massive video to express my uh, unhappiness and share some really... Uh, Macy just barked on a towel. Ew, she and just hey, did. That's great. That's great. <laughs> Thanks, Macy, for ruining my video, barfing on the towel. My phone's there. Disgusting. Um, but yeah, like, got some tea to spill on the whole saddle buying a thing. Um, yeah, it's going to be a video. So let's just pray that this saddle arrives. Ew, look it. It's not that much. Let's just pray that this saddle arrives very soon in early March. Um, and I won't have to spill any tea because who wants to spill tea if you don't have to? But yeah, uh, that's all I can say about the saddle thing. Just know that it is supposed to be done by February 28th. And that's what I'm, I'm praying for. Macy's sick. Yeah, Macy's not sick. She just, she just hacked up a hairball. Wait, wrong pet. <laughs> <laughs> did you, did you hack up a hairball? <laughs> They, know bark. they bark sometimes. Yeah, it yeah. was just a little bit of mucus. That's all it was, huh? She's like, I just love this heat mm. so much. Let me barf. <laughs> <laughs> Let me barf it and clean it. And Toby's like, help, somebody pet me. And Cody's like down here. No, and Cody. Never... It is gorgeous out now. It's something that you guys might want to see that is new. We got a light up there and it works amazing at night. Uh, Sam bought me that water tank yesterday and then we tried to work it and yeah, it was a nightmare. He put it in the barn and it just was not good. So, um, we're going to figure out a way to make it work though. So this is what happened when he brought that water tank in yesterday. All the water, we tried to fill up the buckets and it just sprayed everywhere. It was so annoying. Gabby wants to go on a walk. I think so. Like we, oh, we have to mock. Darn it. It wasn't for the darn chores. Um, yeah, we definitely have to muck. If we can muck really fast, we can go on, on a walk because um, we decided to go ride Dodo and Storm today. It's not our regular day. Well, it is, but. She follows me with this. Yes, pretty girl. So. So, guys, this is how I leave her in and out. So, in from the past. Hey, Miss Willow. How you doing, honey? How you doing? Lunging, Mom. We're gonna try lunging Willow. How you doing? She's like, is that a carrot? So Sophie's been feeding her a carrot every day. She can lunge right now. <laughs> is that a carrot? She's like, I want a carrot. You guys might not know, but she's got blue flecks in her eyes. Uh oh. Mom, I have all the lunging things down No, here. we have to muck stalls. And if you want to go on a walk, walk or lunge? Lunge. Well, what are you gonna do with Stella? Okay, one carrot a day for that little girl because I, know, I only have one of these. Save them for I lunging. And you stare at your window Hoping that you'll come up with some words to say That's not okay When you feel like you're fed up with heartbreak And you know that Lunch time! Over here So, uh I don't know if you guys have noticed, but Stella has started to act like a puppy. A little puppy dog. Uh, neck rope in. So Gabby wants to try and lunge our pretty princess. Uh, she's already shown her the whip and gotten her used to it. Willow's like, oh no, I knew this was coming. We don't know if she knows how to lunge. <laughs> she might not know how to lunge. I would go for Kelly one-on-one. There are good. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. There we go. Aww. 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 
So if you guys didn't know, she got her feet done yesterday. We didn't want to do anything until the farrier came, checked out her feet, and said if she was looking good. Yeah. Stand still. Stand still so you don't stress her out. I'm not stressing her out. But now. Thank you. I'm bonds with them. Yeah, but you'll be doing it too. I know. I'll be freelancing. Yeah, so Gabby's uh, starting it because we don't know how to do it. We don't know Crack how to. Crack the whip. Crack that whip. Crack it. Gibby's. Well, it's like, this is terrible. Out. Thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. She's just not new. Oh my God. Hard work. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, help me, please. I should be having my lunch. Coming down here and feeding the girl, feeding the horses lunch, breakfast, lunch, and then a snack and then supper has been really fun for me. But she just wanted Sophie. This is a learning experience, you guys. You never had a, a mini before. We don't know if she knows how to lunch. And we're trying to be kind and gentle with her. We don't want to be too aggressive because she doesn't really bond with us yet. There we go. Now stay still. Grip, grip, grip. She probably does know how to lunch. She's probably like, oh, these guys don't know how to lunch, so I'm not going to do it. You got it. No, she's doing good. Right, so she's doing really well. Gabby's got her to the point where she actually understands that when she, see that? She moved the whip and did, and then she blew out and told her to stop. See if you can get. All you have to do is walk her with the whip behind her, like telling her to move faster. All right, try it. Let's see her go again. Ah, Try and get her to drop. Good girl. All right, so I want to show you guys what we're dealing with because a lot of you guys are saying stuff like soak the hay in a hay net. Everything freezes here. So all this hay in the bottom of this bucket is frozen to the bucket. Like, I don't want to waste this hay because this is all there. Uh, Stella's soaked hay, but getting it out of the bucket is incredibly difficult. The thing I'm really nervous about is leaving them out Side, um, in the ice during the day uh, because when it's super icy like it makes me really nervous and everybody keeps telling me they know what they can do and they won't go out there if it's really icy and I actually have seen them spend all their time inside if it's icy and then as soon as it gets warmed up outside and it's not as icy boom they go outside so yeah like I'm learning a lot it still makes me nervous though leaving them um, and cleaning up the poop in the arena, which is kind of like important, is really hard in the winter because it's frozen. Frozen poop, frozen hay, frozen hands, but happy heart. All right, you guys. Oh, I don't know if you can see. How do you drive away with that beautiful sight staring at you, standing at the fence waiting for you? We just got home from the barn and the horses are standing outside watching us. Gabby gets out of the car and she's like, Stella! And Stella comes very, trotting very up to the fence. Day will make you sick after you eat it. She made brownies. Our kids hardly eat sugar ever anymore. <laughs> so they share It will make you piece. sick after you eat it because of all the sugar. Yeah, so they're not used to it. It won't make your dad sick. He loves it. Don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe
subscribe button down below.